Hello there, Soul Tribe. Welcome to Joy Says Healing 22. We are still working on the Lion's Gate. I know it had passed. Maybe you've been going through a lot of bullshit. Or maybe you've been growing out a lot of shit. Anyways, I am here to do my Pisces reading. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and or North Pole. Honesty fell out for love. Okay. So Pisces, you need some honesty. Somebody is lying to you. Or pretending. All right. As far as your money, you got humor. I don't got shit funny about money. Oh. Maybe you feel like somebody, um, let me turn this down because I feel like I'm talking over it. Maybe you feel like somebody, um, who is, um, either backed out of a contract or maybe you lost a job. Or maybe you dealing with some people on the job that think shit funny. Or no, you find it funny that these people are even wasting their time fucking with you. That's the spirit that said. I just need one spirit for the love. So Pisces, somebody need to be honest about their feelings. Let's read the card. It says, I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. So you need to be honest about your feelings when it comes to a love situation, Pisces. One car, Holy Spirit, thank you. Romantic feelings, it fell out in the reverse. Oh, Pisces. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. You know you feel a certain way about the person, but you're not exploring shit. Oh, free yourself, damn. I did not mean to take a second card. That just decided to jump out on its own. Okay, so you know your feelings are worth exploring and you need to free yourself from this, from this situation or from a situation. Let's look at your money, Pisces. You need to be honest or somebody is not being honest with you. Grief. Oh, you're about to get a true a true offering takes what can be an unbearable cross and returns to a uh, returns in love. So Pisces, you you're gonna be grieving once you free yourself and be honest with this person or this person be honest with you. As far as your money, I guess you're gonna be gonna be laughing because maybe you have Spirit just told me you had signs, you had intuition, and you didn't have no expectations on this person, but you was hoping for the best. So now you're dealing with some grief when it comes to your money. Tears are what happen when the ice and the heart melts. Okay. Yeah, so Pisces, you might be dealing with some disappointment about money, but Spirit is telling me once you get through this disappointment, you want to be laughing later about it, okay? So calm your ass down. And I know y'all is not broke, because Pisces is not broke. <sighs> Too many. Can I get um, an energy card for my... Um, Indecision. So somebody need to make a decision in love. You are the person you're dealing with, Pisces. What about money? Can I get an energy card for money? Oh. Pisces, are you pissed off about a previous contract that you may have lost some money in? Oh my God. That you refuse to walk away from? Somebody refused to walk away from um, a loveless situation because the romantic romantic feelings are in reverse but the money might be there spirit is telling you to free yourself and your energy is that you are stuck in decision as far as your money someone either you or someone find the situation funny and somebody else is in grief 
and someone need to make a decision on a um, contract and someone is refusing to walk away. Oh, Lord. Either, either way you go, it's going to be a success. So don't worry about that. Let's go to the camper. We can do whatever we want to do. What do we got from our Pisces? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and or North Node. Who is that? Okay, what do we got from our Pisces with love? Any more messages, Spirit? Thank you, guys. Thank you, ancestors. Oh, my God. Pisces. God has been trying to send you a gift or some type of signal or blessing and you are ignoring it you are ignoring your um spirit to say your gift of intuition and discernment you know better why are you trying to invest all with this person can i get one on money humor contract and grief what is my Pisces laughing about? Occupation, okay. So you about done with the business or the people, your clients in your work environment. You trying to make a decision on, on, a, on a few contracts. It's like you like the work or, you know, you like working with people, but it's causing you a lot of grief. And motherfuckers is silly as hell. That's what Spirit has told me. And it's causing you bad health. It's stressing you out. Underlying card for um, gift in reverse and occupation. Health. This shit is causing you stress. Okay. Oh. Pisces, you want to um, offer the Ace of Cup. You may, you may be dealing with somebody with water in their sign. That's offering you the Ace of Pentacles or you offering this person the Ace of Pentacles. But somebody is ignoring the situation, creating fights. Why? Because they are juggling and they cannot make a decision. I'm going to keep you on, honey. You, Pisces, got romantic feelings about somebody who may got strong water in their chart. And they, and you are a gift to this person. But their arrogance and their behavior leave you in indecision. And you need to, and you don't, either you trying to make an offer to this person or this person trying to make an offer to you. Somebody is refusing to offer or trust in the situation. There's some arguments on on board. And somebody, the reason why this person, either you or this person is creating arguments and refuse to make a decision regarding this offer because there's a third party. I'm going to keep you one on it. Either there's a third party or somebody is afraid of commitment. Eight of Cups. Yeah. Oh, my God. Somebody might be walking away. Either you or this person will be walking away from this love, from this love situation. Damn. All right, Pisces, let's go to your money. What is funny? What are you grieving over? What about this contract? What a, why is these cars all sticky and shit? Oh, Empress is trying to show up. You know what I Can I get one card for contract? Let me take what fall on the table. Oh, tower. At any moment, you is about to blow up on your clients or the people you work with or somebody that you are trying to conduct some type of business with. Oh, What's blocking this situation is the Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment. 
you want wish fulfillment, someone is blocking that because they got alternative art, alternative motives. What else? What is the grief about for my Pisces? You need to make a decision. Stop being defensive. You've been healing. You you already talked to God about this, or you need to talk to God more. Oh, these cards are stuck together. But whatever's meant to come on the table is meant. Oh my Lord. Ten of Swords. Oh my God. Pisces. You want an equal give and take? You feel like there is not one and you feel betrayed. But Spirit is saying that everything is fine. Your wish fulfillment is here, but you need to make a decision about a contract. Something that's called it causing you grief and um Defenses. Um, you was very defensive, but you about to speak some type of truth. <sighs> Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Let me go to. Sometimes we go to Karma Tale. I'm gonna take three cards. Pisces says, "I am your worst nightmare." Oh my God! You got a stalker? Or well, somebody pissed off? Or ex-husband or ex-wife that you have not fully separated from is starting shit. Oh no. They feel you feel empty inside, or they feel empty inside. Oh my goodness, Pisces. Are you fucking serious? Cause you have a lot of re oh stop people pleasing, Pisces. You are people pleasing. Or the person oh, Somebody you're dealing with is a fucking full-blown narcissist. And somebody wants a, you want a clean slate or do-over, but long as you was blocking your wish fulfillment is some type of contract or some type of agreement that you need to reconsider. Move on and focus on me and focus on yourself. And I'm going to end it there, my Pisces. Oh, and look at <laughs> Pisces. This is definitely your reading. I love you all. Stop feeling empty inside. Somebody is trying to make you feel like you're, they are your worst nightmare. They're so used to you people pleasing. They are a narcissist. They are very empty inside. You got a clean slate ahead of, to you, ahead of you. But you too worry about this past shit when you need to deal with this contract. Okay? I love you, Pisces. Thank you for joining my channel. Thank you for the likes, shares, subscribes. And oh my God, I am so grateful for all the donations. So I love you all. And eventually, oh, somebody is also walking away in a love situation. I don't know if it's you or that person. But somebody is or need to walk away. And the bottom of the karma deck is Pisces. So, I don't know. You are a divine feminine and you need a family man in your life. This nigga or nigga might just been healing from an STD. But that ain't my business. How many minutes we got? 13? Okay, I'm done. I love you all. God bless. Please like, share, subscribe, and share with your friends. Um... I think I talked about love more than I did money, but uh, far as money, you just need to make some type of decision and know whatever decision you make, it's gonna be fine. You're gonna be prosperous. You might be grieving on some shit or have some type of fear from the past, but spirit wants you to know that you are healed from that and you learn your lessons. And if some don't feel right, don't sign a goddamn contract, okay? We out. Peace out, Pisces.